developments in a story we've been following since October. We now know the identity of the little boy who washed ashore in Galveston. The police have called him Little Jacob, but we have learned that his real name was Jaden Alexander Lopez, a four-year-old. Authorities arrested his mother and her girlfriend yesterday and believe they are tied to the case. Channel 2 Sophia Beausoleil is live in Southwest Houston where the authorities arrested the mother. Sophia. Well, it was a tip from a caller back in March that led them to this apartment right here on the 7200 block of King's Gate rather circle and it's because of that tip they were able to have new information they were able to piece together a timeline and they were able to also question the mother along with the girlfriend and which have now been arrested in connection to this case after eight months we can now put a name with a face little Jacob was Jaden Alexander Lopez the four-year-old whose body washed up on a beach in Galveston last October no one reported Jaden as missing no one was looking for Jaden. Jaden had no advocate other than us. Court documents say a tip led them to Jaden's mother, 34 year old Rebecca Rivera, and her girlfriend, 31 year old Dania Amezquita Gomez, who lives in Houston. It is believed that both of them were present when he was dead, and that both of them came to Galveston and dumped his body. A DNA test confirmed Rivera was the mother, and court documents show Rivera told authorities about two weeks before Jaden died, he bumped into a wall. The mother says she used alcohol to clean the injury, but she and her girlfriend got into a fight, the bottle spilled on the boy's face, and his health started to deteriorate. He complained about stomach aches, and then two weeks later, he died. The court documents state that Rivera said she, her girlfriend, and her other son drove to Galveston in the middle of the night, and she put Jaden's body into the water. Authorities believe the four-year-old died before he entered the ocean, but they don't know what exactly he died from. But autopsy reports showed signs of neglect and injuries consistent with abuse. And when investigators asked the mother why she did not go seek medical help, she told them she was worried that Jaden, along with her other child, would be taken away. We contacted Child Protective Services. They tell us that they have worked with Rivera in the past. They did not go into details in regards to that, but they did tell us that her other young son is currently in the foster care system. Reporting live from Southwest Houston, Sophia Bosley, KPRC, Channel 2 News. Such a sad story on so many levels, Sophia. Thank you.